So you might be in this really weird situation where for some reason your Amazon Fire TV remote is just not pairing up. Now, this can happen for a lot of different reasons out there. The very first thing that Amazon actually recommends you to do is to go ahead and replace the batteries within your controller. So what they recommend doing is going through inside of your particular remote, finding the battery you know, pack panel, which is right in the back, and essentially just going through and replacing these batteries. That is the very first thing you know, Amazon recommends you to do. And that makes a lot of sense. Now, if your batteries are bad, then you can go and replace those batteries entirely or just you know, try to make sure you put them in the right spot. That's basically the first thing that they recommend doing. Now, the other thing they recommend doing is to make sure and move kind of closer to your Amazon Fire Stick or TV device. So if you have your Amazon Fire TV right next to your remote, it should work theoretically. If you're like way super far apart, they recommend 10 feet or less. If you're like 15, 20 feet away, that might mean that your controller, your remote may not work well for that. So just go ahead and actually move closer to your actual Fire Stick. Another thing they recommend doing too is to go ahead and to restart your particular Fire device. So your Fire TV that you have connected, what they recommend doing is going through, essentially plugging it in and then re-plugging it back out. So going through, if it's plugged in, just plug it back out, give it a couple seconds, then plug it back in. And once again, that can very well end up fixing the prompt too. If that still doesn't work, then they recommend going through and actually using the Fire TV application to pair your remote. So going through into your app store of your particular device and downloading the Fire TV app. So you can just go and you know go inside of your app store. You should be able to just type in Fire TV just like this. And you can download the Amazon Fire TV application. I thought this one Fire Remote could work too, but you know, doing this particular application, downloading it, and setting it up this way could be another way to fix it too. So those are a few different ways to go and fix it. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video.